guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm finally back with a fashion lookbook. As all of you guys know, it is back to office time. While it is good news for some, bad news for others, um, I thought I would do a lookbook showing you guys how I would style if I were to go back to the office. To be honest, I'm very lucky because my office is very dressed down and because of the nature of my job, I can wear anything I want every day <laughs> but i know some of you guys work in a corporate setting so mondays to fridays you guys have different dress codes to adhere to so i hope this video will serve as an inspiration to some of you guys and without further ado let's get started the first outfit that i have is this one that i'm currently wearing it's black on black on black because i love styling in a monochromatic way uh, but one way you can kind of dress it up or dress it down is to use different textures different shades within the same family but whereas for black you won't go wrong with it so this one is from Love Ponito I've had it for years and I still wear it as a staple because um, it's very nicely fitted it's kind of cropped but you can always fold it up if you remove the blazer it is actually not your usual black t-shirt it has a very interesting inverted triangle neckline and my pants is from Mong Exavet too. this one is a pair of work pants that I created and I designed with the people going to work in mind because hyper pants make your legs look longer they are also hugging you in the right places so with this I would dress it up with a pair of strappy heels Second outfit, I have a pair of pencil skirts. So I think every corporate office worker needs to have a good pair of pencil skirt in their wardrobe because it hugs you in the right places. Most of the time it's high-waisted, so it gives you an illusion of longer legs as well. And you're not showing too much skin because it usually is relatively long. For tops, I have my Mong X Levet top. This one has a little bit of a bubble sleeve. Um, it's slightly cropped, but because you are pairing it with a high-waisted skirt, it it's not going to look cropped and uh, it's going to hide that little tummy over there and you can always wear it with sleeves up or sleeves down and visually it helps to elongate and give you a very feminine silhouette for my bag i would go in with something more cream colored and for shoes if you are going to be walking a lot if you're going to be taking the transport and taking a long commute to work then a pair of flats will be really good so i've got these pair from clarks they are new they're nice and pointed super comfortable to walk in. It's definitely a staple that everyone should have. Outfit number three, I've got this ensemble over here. So first thing, I have this pair of pants that I wear to death. I love the fit of it. It just makes you look like your waist is extra small. And because it's so flare on the legs, it just creates a very nice and straight silhouette. With that, I'm pairing it with this cowl top. It has kind of nice little details at the front. So it's kind of droopy. It's very romantic. And if you move it around, you can see it's slightly shimmery. It's like a satin material. And if you can't bear your shoulders at work, just throw on a blazer or any outerwear. So this one is from the Willow label. I really like it because um, if you look closely, it is not just your usual solid color. It actually has little specks of brown, so it gives it a little bit more texture. Outfit number four for Thursdays. It is semi-dressed down, semi-formal because it is one day to Friday. So I'm going with the same pair of Love Bonito white flare pants. These are palazzo pants. But for my top, I would go in with this Mong X Levet Savannah top. So I love that um, this one is very nice and flowy. It's so soft. But if you button it all the way up, it's slightly cropped. So it's not as long as your usual shirts. It's not as baggy, it's not as heavy. It just looks nice and light. On the inside, I will go in with a 
white camisole as well so in case i want to kind of just wear this as an outerwear i can so it's quite a similar look but completely different if you just dress it down with sneakers these white ones are from clarks as well um, they are the unreal sprint i love them i have them in so many different colors and so many different versions and this is the latest one that i own it's super super nice and versatile super springy and uh, i can go so long with it Okay, we have reached Friday. So usually offices have dress down Fridays. Um, so of course, I think it doesn't mean that people can go in with like super mini, mini skirts. But what they mean, at least in the places that I've worked at, um, is that you can go to work in jeans. So I've got this pair of denim jeans. I made them from my Marx Levet collection. I love how high-waisted this is. It's really nice and flattering. And it's in this dark wash denim color that goes very well with any top. So over here, I've got two options for you guys, depending on whether or not your company allows you to go sleeveless, or if you're comfortable with going sleeveless, then you can go in with something like this, which is a black turtleneck, because you still look really nice and chic, but it's very nice and light. But if you're a company or you're not comfortable with being sleeveless, then I also have another turtleneck option, but with sleeves. So all in all, it's a very simple, casual, comfortable outfit that allows you to just run around and sit anyhow in it. Um, and I will also pair it with sneakers or pair it with a pair of flats. guys enjoyed this video uh, let me know which outfit is your favorite in the comments box down below and if you did enjoy this video like share and subscribe and talk to me in the comments i'll see you in my next one